गुड इवनिंग फाइनली हेलो गुड इवनिंग यस गुड इवनिंग ऑल ऑफ यू गुड इवनिंग गुड इवनिंग आई गुड इवनिंग ऑल ऑफ यू Did you all practice uh, what we did last time? Great. Now, uh, can I give you uh, one or two sums to try? You are given matrix A. One, two, minus one, minus two. And matrix B is given two A minus one B. Also given A plus B. Are you able to hear me? Because there's there's been a lot of network issues since morning. Okay, great. A plus B the whole square is. A square plus B square. You have to find the values of A and B. Uh, should I explain how to do it? On the uh, start, see you have to use what is given. A plus B the whole square. You know what is A plus B the whole square? I had explained to you last time. A plus B into A plus B. Which is given to you as a square plus b square. Now, when you open this bracket, it is a into a plus b. So I am writing directly now a square plus a b plus b a plus b square. It is given to you as a square plus b square. So you can cancel a square b square from either side. So you will have a b plus b a is a null matrix. So in short, if this is given, it means that this is given to you. All of you follow? So you write your a, multiply a by b on this side. Is minus of b into a. Or you can try this. All are two by two, so you will use first row and first column. So one into two plus two into minus one. Can I directly write now? You are comfortable with the product, everybody. Okay. So it is two minus two that is zero. Then one into a plus two into b minus two and plus two. Oh, you want me to write six? Okay. See, you will go row wise for the first and column wise for the second. So it is one into two plus two into minus one. Then for this element, you will use first row but second column. So it's one into a plus two into b. For the second row, you will use second row with first column and then second row with second column. So minus one into two plus minus two into minus one and minus one into a minus two into b. This is your left hand side. Same thing here. Those who understand directly can go ahead. I mean, you don't have to write also. Shauni, are you able to understand better? Okay. 
okay it is 2 into 1 plus a into minus 1 then 2 into 2 plus a into minus 2 then yeah i got minus 1 see there is a minus sign here don't forget minus 1 into 1 plus b into perfect so it will your answer is absolutely correct minus 1 into 2 plus b into minus 2 you can skip this step this is what i wanted to tell you so this is 2 minus 2 you will have 0 minus 2 plus 2 you will have 0 a plus 2b and minus of a plus 2b is equal to minus of see this will be 2 minus a so if i multiply uh, will you understand i am otherwise i'll die then here it will be minus b minus 1 if i mcq it's it na bas you will equate this with this and this with this and get a and b so this is a formality we have to write this is 4 minus 2a Correct. And it's clearly minus 2 minus 2. So yeah, just check your answer right here. So you will have 0, 0, a plus 2b minus of a plus 2b. Change the signs here, a minus 2. Yeah, when you are multiplying each term by minus sign, so will you not equate this with this corresponding elements by equality of matrices? So that gives you a minus 2 is 0. So you will have AS2 and this with this. So 0 is equal to B plus 1. Got it? Shriya, how you got B as negative 5? Can you please check? No problem. No problem. You, you got your uh, error numbers. You got it right. Very good. So he has already written AS2 and BS minus 1. Anybody writing, copying, solving? Done. this is how i started a was given b was given given condition i started and rather than finding a plus b then multiplying that then finding a square then finding b square and then equating this is much easier correct yeah. very good. you try every sum what i'm giving you today huh You, you could get homework sums. One though I showed you and uh, the other one.
Yes, we have to do probability also. I will just take a few sums and then I will I can start with probability. No problem. You have to multiply this with this and then this with this. You can take any two multiplications first. Yeah, and here yeah, there are three rows. So we search on side manicure, one row and three columns. And here yeah, three rows and three columns. Yeah, equal is the product is possible and order of the product is one by three. But so a row hoga and team columns as up answer, hoga, right? So ye is ye first row and first column, first row and second column, first row and third column. So make a first row row has a use can I column they have use. Karna. So first row and first column. So it is one into one plus x into four plus one into three. Ye ho gaya mera even one. Abhi I will take first row and second column. So it is one into two plus x into five plus one into two. And baad first row and third column. It is one into three plus x into six plus one into five into one minus two three. is equal to zero a year of so this is my four x plus four six six minus eight Zero means this is not zero, it's a null matrix. Abhi iska order kya hai bolo? What is the order of this? One row and three columns. And iska hai three row and three rows and one column. So mera order aega one by one only. Perfect. Answer the check karna yash. So it is this into this. So 4x plus 4 into 1 plus 5x plus 4 into minus 2 plus 6x plus 8 into 3. A key element is equal to this element. See, this is a null matrix. And this order 1 by 1 is 1 by 1 ka null matrix. So, ye 4x hai, ye 18x hai ga, and ye minus 10x hai ga. Correct? So, 18x minus 10x, 8 plus 4, this is 12x. This is 24, minus 8, 16 plus 4, 20. Yes, Shriya. Four five four three. Got it. See, today's sums now they will be very helpful for your MCQs. Remember that. For your 19th May test, you have probability. Oh, God. Okay. Take care.
you did everything based here am i not everything is done multiplication theorem you have college or no total is been done in probability you have no but what do you have bayes theorem who attends but can you get the pdf for something that you know will uh, because precisely i will check what all you have huh? okay sum number 3 express a four to three and minus five as means a should be written as something plus something this something should be symmetric matrix and this should be skew symmetric matrix means you have to express this as a sum of symmetric and skew symmetric matrices this is what the sum is now regarding transpose you can uh, give it to him mangi ma'am she will pass it on to me shami you got, i got the pdf of deleted portion no i have got deleted portion uh, uh, that even i know what is there what is not there it's not about that but in colleges no like in sathi college there were in exam in limits they did not take sums with infinite infinity and they had uh, deleted exponential and logarithmic uh, logarithmic limits though it is there in the syllabus that's why okay now in transpose you remember what is a symmetric matrix to remembers when it is symmetric you can take from your friend and give it to uh, uh, imangi ma'am i'll take it from her yes absolutely correct a is a transpose skew symmetric hota hai if a is minus of a transpose correct then we saw a transpose ka transpose is a itself then a plus b ka transpose is a transpose plus b transpose agar yahan minus hai to yahan minus hai okay ayush no problem thank you i will check and i will cover everything don't worry then important thing na mcq ke liye a b product ka transpose is b transpose into a transpose ye property yaad rakh mcq ke liye. so that you know they will give you one sum a denge and b denge then you will have to choose one of the options here direct property use you can do ab transpose is b transpose into a transpose and for any square matrix a a is written as aadha will be a plus a transpose plus aadha will be a minus a transpose sorry a a minus a transpose so this part will be symmetric a plus a transpose is always symmetric and this part is always skew symmetric remember this now if you know this property it's just one deleted portion given by the board we haven't been notified by the deduction done by the college on their level okay fine no problem 
I can teach. To take the gist of all the entire probability one lecture is good enough for me. I will explain. I'll make your concepts absolutely crystal clear. Don't worry. So, if you have to ask this symmetric part, what is A given? Bolo? 4 minus 2, 3 minus 5. Therefore, is ka transpose kya hoga? First row will become first column. Second row will become second column. So symmetric part will be aga of A plus A transpose. That is aga of this matrix A plus this matrix A transpose, which is 4 minus 2, 3 minus 5. 4, 3, minus 2, minus 5. Here. So you can multiply and write. So ye ho gaya symmetric part. This part is symmetric. And skew symmetric ke liye find half of A minus A transpose. Correct? So we are here. So your matrix A is this plus this. If you simplify karke nahi likhna hai. Simplify karke likhoge to you will go back to the, what is given na? This is your answer. This part is symmetric. This part is Q symmetric. Half of A plus A transpose. Remember this property. Half of A plus A transpose A wala plus half of A minus A transpose A wala. Is that clear? Anybody writing this, please? We'll go to some number five. Try. Single matrix. You have to find the value of lambda.
पहले ये मैट्रिक्स तो निकालो सो इट इज वन थ्री टू टू माइनस लैमडा आई ऑफ द सेम ऑर्डर So it's one minus lambda, three minus zero, two minus zero, and two minus lambda. This is a minus lambda into i, correct? Now this is a singular matrix. Therefore, its determinant will be zero. मतलब determinant one minus lambda, three, two, two minus lambda. This determinant will be zero. So it is this into this minus two into three is equal to zero. So it is two minus two lambda minus lambda. So you will have lambda square minus three lambda minus four is equal to zero. Everybody gets that. So factorize. Got it. First, I found the matrix A minus alpha lambda into I because it's singular. This matrix is singular. This is a singular matrix. Yes, Palam. So the value of its determinant will be zero. Any doubt is there? Hello. Himanshu, no. Okay. Anybody wants to take a screenshot, or you all understood? Yes, 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 yes. So, but they haven't uh, given no lambda. So these are the possibilities, you know. In MCQ, so they will not ask such a uh, lengthy sum, you know. They will give you a condition like this. Four conditions they give. They may stop here for MCQ. Okay. Now, if your matrix A is alpha two two alpha. And value of the determinant a q is one twenty five. Find the lambda. Now this is a typical MCQ stuff. इसमें अपना ज्यादा दिमाग नहीं यूज करना है बिकॉज अभी तुम लोगों को एमसीक्यू एग्जाम में इसलिए आई एम गिविंग यू दिस अदरवाइज तो दे वुड गिव यू इन सीट यूर इफ वैल्यू ऑफ द डिटर्मिनेंट इज के देन वैल्यू ऑफ डिटर्मिनेंट ए स्क्वायर मतलब ए स्क्वायर कैसे निकालोगे ए इंटू ए मेट्रिक्स आएगा उसका डिटर्मिनेंट विल बी के स्क्वायर determinant a cube ka value will be k cube and so on do you follow that you remember this note ye kaam mein aayega shortcut hai abhi listen to me what i am saying using this if determinant a cube mera 5 cube hai what does that imply who will tell me? One twenty-five is five cube. Huh? Follow. 
Deter perfect. Value of the determinant A will be 5. Superb. Excellent. We are going back like this. If this, then this. If this, then that. Okay. So determinant hai alpha 2 to alpha is equal to 5. So I get alpha square minus 4 is 5. So alpha square is 9. So alpha will be plus or minus 3. Perfect. Very good. So these are because the college exam is uh, typically um, MCQ. No? So I have to give you something. Which are typically MCQ questions. Correct. If f of x. f of a kya hoga if you want to try this minus 2 1 0 3 f of x is 2x square minus 3x so what will my f of a be it will be 2a square minus 3a. Is it not x? I will replace. Probability, I can do it on Tuesday. Tuesday is what date? When is your paper? When is your paper? Oh, you have the paper on the 19th. Can I ask, sir, if I could take a lecture on Saturday or Sunday? I don't mind. So we will get two lectures on probability. One lecture is enough for me to explain you the entire gist, multiplication theorem and everything. You know, last 10 minutes, I will just give you the formula so that you can start learning. Have you done probability in CET or uh, in uh, JWE? Both of exams start from 15th of May. Today is 13th. No, Saturday, Sunday, I was asking if uh, I will have to speak to sir if uh, Saturday is okay. If you say yes. Everybody, yeah. If everybody is okay, then I can take. Sunday is okay. Thank you. We will have a word with sir and then we can decide. Okay. Chalo, you do this now. F of A, kaise karoge? 2A square minus 3A. Yes to him. Saturday and Sunday both are okay. Now I will have a word with sir. I will take one lecture. No problem. 2 to 4 30 for exam. No, I can take any time. It's a question. Multiply the two. This is 4 plus 0. Minus 2 plus 3. 0 plus 0 and 0 plus 9. 3 is a multiplier. Minus 6, 3, 0 and 9. A to minus minus 6. So this is 14. Then you will have minus 1. Zero and nine. This is your answer. This type of sum they ask, you know, in MCQs. 
because it's a combination sum. It's a combination of functions and matrices. Or the earlier sum is a combination of determinants and matrices. Yes, word problems are also there for determinants and matrices. They're forming equations, basically. But normally, you know, I don't know this year, but last year, all these word problems, they used to keep it for practicals. They would never ask in the exam. If you want, I can take one word problem. We can form the equation and leave it. Chalega. If A alpha is, this you can cos alpha, sin alpha, minus sin alpha, and cos alpha. In MCQ, they are asked you, therefore, A alpha, A beta. And there were four options. You just find A alpha into A beta. Cos alpha, sin alpha, A beta ke liye alpha you will have to replace by beta. A alpha plus A beta, yeah. check up. It is cos alpha, cos beta minus sin alpha, sin beta. So it is cos of alpha plus beta. Then it is sin alpha, cos beta plus cos alpha, sin beta. It is sin of alpha plus beta. Then minus sin alpha, cos beta, minus cos alpha, sin beta, minus sin taken. And minus minus sin alpha sin beta plus cos alpha cos beta again. Don't you think it is A of alpha plus beta? Yeah, everywhere, wherever it is alpha, everywhere it is alpha plus beta, correct? So it is A, A alpha plus A beta, ne. it is A of alpha plus beta. A alpha plus A beta, alag hai, huh? see I'll tell you, it is not equal to A alpha plus A beta. Mind it, huh? ye nahi hai. Ye nahi. Okay. Are you clear? I'm secure. Points are collinear. Yeah, they're good. If points are collinear. What does that mean? Area triangle ABC is zero. It is half x1 by 1, 1, x2 by 2, 1 x3 by 3 1 is 0. Do you remember this? So half chala jayega. I can cross multiply. So it means that ye pehla point is x1 by 1. So it's a 0 1, 0 b 1. Third point hai, 1 1 1 is equal to 0. Therefore, you will have A into 
b minus 1 minus 0 into 0 minus 1 1 into 0 minus b oh you want me to scroll up kya chahiye shriya is do you want this better Share. You want me to scroll up further? In a one twenty two, A one two. Okay. No, 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 wait a minute. Shriya, uh, this is A12. Yeah. Yeah, banana. See, it is cos alpha. I'll write it. Cos alpha sine beta plus sine alpha cos beta. Only a term, but a term for the sin alpha, cos beta plus cos alpha, sin beta. It is sin of alpha plus beta. Okay? Yes, uh, so how you are right? You have to divide by AB. So, yeah, I have AB minus A, this is 0, this is 0. Minus B is equal to 0. So, I got my AB is equal to A plus B. So dividing throughout by AB. So when you divide one A by AB is one by B. B by AB is one by A. So it's the answer which I they have asked you one upon A plus one upon B. So your answer will be one. Perfect, so yes. Anybody writing this? Please show the question. Okay. Three points are collinear. MCQ hai. One upon A plus one upon B is what? Points are collinear. Area of a triangle is zero. So half koi kaam ka nahi hai. Multiplying both sides by two. First point one, second point one, third point one. As a determinant, are there. correct? Let me know. Done. Okay, now take the next question. If If the value of this determinant is zero, a b a plus b b c b plus c a plus b b plus c zero, then a b c are in. There are four options. They are in a p. They are in g p.
they are in H V. And then none of these. B here will the property come. Here will the property come. Can you think of any property or should I show you? Try changing R1 to R1 plus R2 minus R3. So, kya hoga? Ye dono add karke, ye subtract hoga, to yaar zero mil jayega. You are, what you write first, that changes. So, R1 is changing to R1 plus R2 minus of R3. So, it will be like A, A ke jaga, I'll show you up me. A ke jaga aega, A plus B minus of A plus B. Are you getting? Ye corresponding element mein, R3. So, A plus B minus of A plus B, it gives you zero. Similarly, here B plus C minus of B plus C, yaha zero aega. And then yaha aega this plus this minus zero. So, yaha aega A plus 2B plus C. Correct? We did this operation. Huh? We, whenever we have anything in common in any row or in column, we can easily take it out. Ye mera common aagya bahar. So, ye easy padega. 0, 0, 1 hoga. Because 0 and 0 me se mene ye common liya. Which is B, C, B plus C. A plus B, B plus C and 0. actually diya kya hai ye zero diya hai this is given to you as zero dekh rahe hai yaha pe so what i operation i did is equal to zero what operation i did is equal to zero so i can divide by a plus 2b plus c so zero is equal to divide kya to gaya so ye zero into kuch nahi aayega jo bhi hai minus zero into kuch nahi aayega plus 1 into this into this b into b plus c minus c into a plus b. So we will have 0 is equal to e open karo, b square plus bc minus ac minus bc. So ac udar dalo. ac is equal to b square. Bolo, what does that imply? A, B, C, R, N, G, P, perfect. Agar, if they were in A, P, then what would be my B, Bolo? Yeah, Atuhin, what do you want the last step? Uh, you want this step better? Third last step, one, one minute. One, two, three. Do you want this step? Do you want this step? Okay. Okay. You know, you understand the value of the determinant is given to you as zero. Correct? Now, what you have learned in determinants that if anything is common in a row or a column, I can take it out. Unlike in matrices. Matrices, if I have common, then I have matrix ke each element mein common. Chahiye. But in determinant, I can have something in common 
इन एनी वन रो और इन एनी वन कॉलम सो जीरो एक ऐसी चीज है जिसमें से मैं कुछ भी कॉमन निकाल सकती हूँ सो ये दो जीरो ने हमलेस तो मैंने फर्स्ट रो से ए प्लस टू बी प्लस सी कॉमन निकाला बिकॉज माई कैलकुलेशन बिकम स्मॉलर जीरो जीरो वन आ गया एंड ये बाहर आ गया बाकी सारा सेम रहा अभी आई एम डिवाइडिंग बोथ साइड बाई ए प्लस टू बी प्लस सी सो जीरो अपॉन दैट विल बी जीरो एंड ये कैंसिल हो गया फिर ये जो डिटर्मिनेंट है इसका जीरो इंटू एनीथिंग माइनस जीरो इंटू एनीथिंग एंड प्लस वन इंटू एनीथिंग आर यू क्लियर अबाउट दिस ओके ग्रेट anybody else oh i was asking you agar mera ap mein hote the numbers so what would be beech ka number bolo a plus c by 2 kaise karna hai na go by logic you know agar mujhe suppose uh, you welcome to him agar suppose mujhe nahi aa raha hai to bhi i will apply my logic What do you mean by an AP? दूसरा माइनस पहला इज इक्वल टू तीसरा माइनस दूसरा तो ये ए इधर आएगा C प्लस ए इज टू बी दट इज हाई गेट अगर तुम भूल भी जाते हो ना तो भी यू कैन जस्ट अप्लाई लॉजिक अगर एच पी में है एच पी का मतलब क्या है रेसी प्रोकल्स आर इन ए पी ए बी सी इफ दे आर इन एच पी मतलब वन बाय ए वन बाय बी परफेक्ट हार्मोनिक मीन बोलते हैं सुपर दे आर इन ए पी तो यूला दूसरा माइनस पहला इज इक्वल टू तीसरा माइनस दूसरा तो ये ये बाजू आएगा सो इट इज टू बाय बी इज वन बाय सी प्लस वन बाय ए आई एम जस्ट शोइंग यू द लॉजिक टू बाय बी इज इक्वल टू ए प्लस सी अपॉन ए सी उल्टा करो क्रॉस मल्टीप्लाई करके बी इज इक्वल टू 2ac upon a plus b. अगर तीन नंबर एच पी में होते तो ओके ऑल ऑफ यू फॉलो एंड यू अंडरस्टूड हाउ टू यूज द प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ अ डिटर्मिनेंट ऑल्सो एवरीबडी गॉट इट Thank you. Now, yeah, actually, MCQ ka hai, but I will like show that. तो एक्चुअली एमसीक्यू में कैसे है ना दिस डिटर्मिनेंट इज गिवन एंड फोर ऑप्शन स्क्रोल अप यस विच पार्ट यू वॉन्ट बेटा you want this or you want further uh, scrolling up or down for oh, ap and hp okay हार्मोनिक 
जीबी की जो रहती है मीन दैट इज बी स्क्वायर इक्वल टू ए सी मीन दैट वी राइट जी एंड यू नो दैट जी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू ए एच ये भी पता है सारे प्रॉपर्टीज मीन्स के चलो व्हाट आई कैन डू इज यू नो मैं सारे लोगों को साथ में ले लूंगी पहले दो 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 है उसका मैं तीन बनाती हूँ मीन्स आई विल डू माय सॉरी यहाँ कुछ हो गया ना नहीं तो वो उसके ऊपर लाइन आ गया या यू नो व्हाट आई डू इज सी वन आई विल चेंज टू सी वन प्लस सी टू प्लस सी थ्री एल एच एस में डन सो ये दो बार ए दो बार बी दो बार सी तो ये ऐसे आ गया टू ए प्लस टू बी प्लस टू सी टू पी प्लस टू क्यू प्लस टू आर एक्स प्लस वाई प्लस जेड के बाद ना हम लोग यहां से टू बाहर निकालेंगे फर्स्ट कॉलम से अभी मुझे सिंगल डिजिट में जाना है इतना मुझे समझता है सो यू नो व्हाट आई डू इज आई विल चेंज सी टू टू सी इधर यू चेंज सी टू टू सी टू माइनस सी वन C3, you can change to C3 minus C1. So I can do this simultaneously in one step. I am operating C2 and I am operating C3 with the help of C1. When I am operating C2, then I am using C3. I cannot use because that itself is getting changed. But this I can do it in one step. So if I suppose I am same here. If I want to, I'll do this minus this. So here, what came out? Minus b. Here came out minus q. And this minus this. Here came out minus y. Similarly, this minus this. Here came out minus c. Then here came out minus r minus z. So one step me ho gaya. Come. So understood. अभी यहां सिंगल लाना है मुझे फर्स्ट रो में सो माई सी वन आई एम चेंजिंग टू सी वन प्लस सी टू प्लस सी थ्री मतलब ये माइनस माइनस कैंसिल करेंगे इसको सीधा ऐड करो तो यहाँ ए आया यहाँ पी आया यहाँ एक्स आया माइनस बी माइनस क्यू माइनस वाई माइनस सी माइनस आर माइनस जेड समझा उसके बाद सेकेंड कॉलम से आई विल टेक माइनस साइन कॉमन एंड थर्ड कॉलम से आई विल टेक माइनस साइन कॉमन तो यह आ गया ए पी एक्स बी क्यू वाई सी आर जेड सो माइनस माइनस प्लस हो जाएगा सो दैट इज व्हाट इज आस्ट टू प्रूव करेक्ट
So that is your arrangement. I'm not copying now because we can do one more sum rather than copy. Uh, so he, uh, how will we know how to add or subtract and when? Uh, you know what, these sums is a challenge. You have to use property. If I always see it, if I want a single single, I will get everything with me. So what is the benefit of taking it with me? Like I have taken it here. Three are coming. So this minus this kya to yaha single laega. This minus this kya to yaha single laega. So ye do single use karke ye teen mein se do cut karo after getting it wrong. So it is only trial and error by judgment. When we solve three four sums na, you will get it. Do you want to do one sum on your own just now? ये हो गया सबका विदाउट एक्सपैंडिंग है अभी एमसीक्यू में आएगा ही नहीं बट जस्ट तू प्रूव दैट तुम लोगों का थिंकिंग इंप्रूव है This determinant is equal to zero. Oh, you're done already. Very good, Tohin. Super. How did you do? Oh, this is not done. How would you do this? Anyone? Okay, no problem. I can give you the hint. You want the hint? Prove D is equal to minus D. So it is a clear. Somehow we have to prove D is equal to minus D. So ye minus D either I got two D is zero, therefore D is equal to zero. A bit in a hint to many the air. कॉमन निकालो बड़ी बॉन्ड आई मीन द लेक्चर आई लव आई हैव गिवन यू द हिंड 
You can try for homework also. It's a good thing. Yeah. And I'll give you two more so that you know your thinking process will start. You know what you do? Pele D Riko, I will tell you. Uske bad you write rows as columns. Because if you write, you didn't understand a hint. See, this is your D. You do some changes here. So this will be minus D. They say, up agar first row hai, usko first column likho. Correct? Second row hai, usko up second column likho. And wo up third column likho. What will happen, tell me? If rows are written as columns, will the value change? Rows as columns likha. So value nahi change hoga. But do you understand the first step? I have written first row as first column, second row as second column, third row as third column. So the value did not change. So agar ye mera pehle d tha, to ye bhi d hi ho gaya. Correct? Abhi, first row se minus one common nikalo. Second row say minus one common nikalo. Third row say minus one common nikalo. So first row say minus common nikala to ye agya mera zero b minus c. Ye agya minus b zero a. Ye agya c minus a zero, right? First, I call the given determinant as d. Uske baad first row as first column, second row as second column, third row as third column. So, mera D, D hi rahega. Correct? And then, mene har ek row se minus, minus, minus common nikala hai. So, what is minus 1 into minus 1 into minus 1? Three times hai, to minus sign aega. Aur ye kya hai mera bolo ye? Is it not D itself? So D is equal to minus D. So D plus D minus D either lena. So 2D is 0, therefore D is 0. Yeah. Understood? Crazy a dollar. Got it, na? Just take one more. You take it for homework because you have a lecture now. Nahi aaye to bolna please. Do that because ye samajna bahut jaruri hai. Aage jaake lagega. Otherwise, we can always do this next time. Probability khatam karke, I will be broken. Matab, ek ek row se ya ek ek column se a minus 1, a minus 1, a minus 1 nikalne wala hai. Okay? Chalo then. Thank you very much. You can try this for homework. And next time I will take probability and I will talk to sir on for Saturday or Sunday. Then uh, we can do probability. We'll have good two lectures for probability. All right. Chalo, thank you so much. Bye-bye. Uh, we have to expand in this uh, one. Which one? Ye expand nahi karna hai. I will give you the hint. Agar mene abhi ye R1, if I change to R1 minus R2, see to hint. R1, if I change to R1 minus R2, 
it will be a square plus 2a minus of 2a plus 1. So 2a, 2a cancel. A square minus 1 aega. So a plus 1, a minus 1 aega. Yaha aega a minus 1 and 1 minus 1, 0. So first row say you can take a minus 1 common. Uske bar aap r2 minus r3 kar sakte ho. So, this 2a minus 2 hoga, which is 2 into bracket a minus 1. Yaha a minus 1 hoga, yaha 0. Hoga. Okay? Followed? At least try it. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Have a nice day. Bye. Stay blessed. Bye.